viewers today's uh, demonstration is very simple and straightforward a short video about asset balances report in sap s4 hana so for this purpose we need to uh, we need to select the reporting for asset accounting group and then we need to select the asset balances uh, ff for application let's find it out Also, it is available here in Asset Accounting General Reporting, Asset Balances. So, it will uh, list all uh, all the posted asset of uh, the in, inside our company code, uh, which is 101, so in our case, by cost center wise. So, there will be a prompt. We need to select the key figure group here, and uh, company code, and then uh, ledger area, which is 2A in our case. Then depreciation area which is 32 in our case and then we need to select the year fiscal year and also two period two period also need to be selected which is six which is uh, you know Various uh, periods are available here. So six a period is uh, also uh, representing the fiscal period, and uh, then the currency type need to be ten here. This is company code currency. We are not using group currency here. Okay, and uh, that's it. Then we will press OK. It will take some time depending upon your case to case. And uh, then we can drag the asset cost center from available field to the top of the list of fields and rows. Once it's done, then we can export to Excel. Okay. At the top uh, right corner, there is a button. Uh, this button is available in every screen. If you want to export anything, uh, from the screen in SAP S4 HANA to, ex, uh, to Excel. So that is available. We will choose that one. Uh, there are, you know, various uh, asset class and asset cost centers, and, you know, uh, in this report or in this screen, uh, various assets are shown here with the uh, value. Okay, then we'll export to Excel. The same data will be transferred to the Excel file and we will open the Excel file. Okay, here is our data. We will uh, enable the editing and adjust uh, the report as per our needs. And uh, the query name, info provider, and uh, the created date and the time and the who has created is also available, the long details variables which were selected and the data which was shown in that report. And that report is very flexible. You can uh, drag and drop the fields in a row or column definition. And then uh, the same representation you can export to Excel. It is available just like you can see here. This is details of all the asset and their values. And this is pretty straightforward and I hope you must have uh, I mean, enjoyed it. And similarly, you can work in other reports in asset area.
and uh, it's very flexible. A anything you can uh, export to Excel, and uh, if you want to edit it or if you want to change the representation or formatting of the report, it's, it's quite flexible. So. So various asset class are shown and with the description and cost center and then uh, the balance amount and you know in terms of euro it is shown so this is it thank you very much for watching the video and uh, i hope you enjoyed it if you enjoy please subscribe to my channel thank you very much